What is usually a busy newsroom for the Daily Evergreen is now idle. While it may look empty, their efforts are opposite. Editor-in-chief of the Daily Evergreen, Angelica Relenti, says that they're working just as hard as they did before COVID-19. Right now, it's easy for people to assume that, like, oh, they're online now. They only print once a week, which means less work, right? That's wrong. <laughs> We're still doing the same work, and if not, maybe even more. But that doesn't mean that they haven't had their fair share of challenges with the change. Angelica says that they've had to work harder to communicate with one another because they're not in person. While they're trying to remain active, WSU senior Rebecca Schneider says that she doesn't fully rely on them for news. I give them the benefit of the doubt. Like, they're not going to be perfect. Um, so I don't think they're necessarily the most reliable, but they're students who are learning. And when it comes to campus things, I'll, I'll read it, but um, that's just how I go about looking for news too, I guess. Nevertheless, the Daily Evergreen continues to provide news to those in the Pullman community. With Kate Egg Bionni, I'm Pamela Alarcon, Marrow News 8.